farmhands farmer reef here uh, welcome back to the phoenix 700 build we're down here in the phoenix uh, fish room today i just want to show you i have uh, my one sump built right here this is a 40 gallon i end up going with acrylic on this one so i'm going to show you what my plans are how i'm going to make this work i'm going to plumb it from the 700 upstairs coming down across the ceiling so what we have to do is we have to install some bulkheads i got six pipes going into it and that's where the the deltec skimmer going is the 3070 so it's going to be pretty awesome so today i just wanted to show you the sump i built and what i made it out of i chose those colors i chose to go with uh, the red black and clear to give that phoenix uh, feel and it's going to look really good popping the skimmer in there everything's really going to pop really nicely so i'm just going to show you a little tour today and uh, how this is all going to work and plan out um, then we're going to go ahead in another episode we're going to do start doing all the plumbing to it and then i'm going to do unbox to show you the skimmer i went with with the nice dell tech and the pumps in that it's going to look really great and then we'll have a whole bunch of other uh unboxing videos coming up to show you all the gear that's going to be down here in the phoenix 700 fish room so let's go ahead come on over we'll check out this sump and see what you guys think all right, farmhand. So this is the the 40 gallon I end up uh, making here. You guys can see I got nice red uh, acrylic along the top, give it that fire look. Um, it's hard to tell because the background's already black, but we got black acrylic on the the back, two sides, and black on the bottom. So looking great. And then you can see through with the acrylic on the front, so you can see the skimmer and see all the action that's going on. So that's what I end up going with. It's a really nice uh, build. It's gonna look really nice. Um, we just put the skimmer right here. We got the light it's gonna shine on it's almost like a showpiece is the plan um so what's it we're gonna do so i end up i got three uh i just got three of these here right now the one inch uh bulkheads i end up getting them for like 650 a piece i think i picked these ones up at big owls and um so what's gonna happen is so i'll have three pipes coming down on the back side here so we're gonna have to uh drill these in and then i'm gonna add another six or another three on the other side as well so we're gonna end up putting them in i went uh slip slip so there's no threads at all, so no leaking. So I'll end up, we're gonna drill those through, just like that. And then we're gonna add a piece of pipe in the bottom. So people are saying, oh, because you're gonna do a two layered sump, there's gonna be a lot of, uh, you say detritus or any stuff laying in here. So if I have my sump here in the middle and I add all my bulkheads, there's gonna be lots and lots of flow. So I'll end up, I'll put pieces of pipe in here and I'll be able to direct it into the, the skimmer. Plus I can add them in a different, uh, location and then they can direct the flow and to give that swirling effect and there shouldn't be much uh you know build up of uh detritus or anything in there so that's my plan if we got lots of flow and then i don't have to put any power heads in there to consume any more power so that's the plan and then what's going to happen is here on this side here I end up, i'm going to drill this out another uh, couple bulkheads to go down into the the next uh sump so it's going to look pretty sweet so this is what i end up with and it turned out uh, really nice so that's the plan. So all I have to do now is uh, get my hole saw, measure out my spacing for the first three pipes coming from the from the 700. It's gonna be somewhere around there, I'm thinking, get my spacing, because I got a pot light, of course, when I designed that. Probably shouldn't have put it exactly in the center, but I'll work around it, and then we'll add the next three, space them out on the other side, just like that. So we'll have lots of uh, wicked flow. So that's the plan, guys. I just wanted to share that with you how things are going then i just got to get do all the piping across the ceiling right here boom and i'm planning on matching all the piping it was going to be a uh, black pipe i mean red pipe with all black fittings and it's going to look really sweet give it that phoenix fire look to it so pretty cool hey eh, guys all right farms all right farm hands so i just wanted to show you uh that sump that i built so you guys can see uh, the progress that's going on. So next it's gonna be coming up. We're gonna start the plumbing, get that all uh, arranged, and then we're gonna start hooking up all the gear and I can't wait to show you all the pumps I got and everything that's gonna be running in this Phoenix uh, 700. So it's gonna be pretty exciting. So thanks for tuning in this week, guys. I really appreciate it. If you guys could please subscribe and hit the like button.